I have made a new album, my first recording in 44 years, and I never thought I would be doing this, and it has been wonderful. It's called The Fetch, and it's been a joy to make. It was uh, a joy to just to start working with her again. Um, process was seamless because we knew each other, we knew each other's strengths, weaknesses. We're both passionate about music, so we wanted to just do something that we liked. Simple as that. Made a Veil is a song about my time with affinity. Red and blue on the slow Bakerloo, dressed in a khaki coat, worried a month overdue. People came out of the woodwork for this. Wonderful people, including the guy who was my um, engineer on Pieces of Me. Mo said, we were wondering, as you were involved in the original one, if you'd like to be involved in this one. I said, I'll pay my own way to come and mix it. And of course, this is exactly what happened. I flew myself out to Canada to mix the album. There's a song on the um, album called Confessional, and it genuinely is. Every phrase, everything that I state in that song has happened to me or I've experienced. I've touched a lunar moth, seen its wings disturb the air, felt an earthquake shake my body, twice refused a millionaire, dragged a drowning man from sea foam, let Shelley Winters comb my hair. Mo said, I'm gonna get Ray to put on his Moody Dolphins. There's this difference between writing as a young person and writing as an older person. And I think as Mo said to me, when I, I resisted and resisted, and then once I started, it was like taking a cork out of a bottle. It just came. In fact, I'm still writing now, and there's so much that I'm writing um, I'm having to restrain myself from getting on with my next album. <laughs> I sat beside a suicide whose love I sadly lost. Led a milkman's horse to water as we slipped across the front.